Hi, my name is Sarah Helms, and I am the department manager for linguistics at Western Washington University, and I also do advising for the department. In this video, I am going to show you how to declare the major or the minor, and I'm going to talk about some of the requirements. So first of all, I am at our department's website at thss.wwu.edu slash linguistics. You can also find our department website by just googling WWU linguistics and generally it is the first result that will come up on the page. So this is our home page. Feel free to come here and explore. We have lots of different interesting updates and information about the department. I'm going to go here to our advising tab. On the left side of the screen are different categories under the advising tab. We're going to go to the major tab. This page talks about all of the different requirements for the linguistics major at Western. If you'd like to see a PDF guide to declaring the linguistics major or minor, you can click at this, on this link at the top of the page and it will open up a PDF of the major and minor requirements and how to declare. So at the top of the page is some information about the major and linguistics in general. Here we see information on how to declare. The first step to declaring the linguistics major is completing Linguistics 201, Introduction to Linguistics, or an equivalent course such as English 370, TESOL 401, or Teaching English to Speakers of Other Languages 401, Anthropology 247, or Honors 217, with a grade of B- minus or better. Once you have completed that one prerequisite, we can get you declared as a linguistics major. When you're ready to declare, you would fill out the major declaration and change web form. You can find a link to it here and also in our PDF guide on how to declare. Once you have filled out that form and emailed it to linguistics at www.edu, I will contact you through email and we will complete a major checklist, which you can see here, there's a link to it. Let me show you what that looks like. This is our linguistics major degree planning guide. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to find our requirements on the Western's catalog website. So I'm just going to search for WW catalog. I realize you cannot see what I'm typing in. And here we go. So we always want to make sure that we're in the correct catalog year. And for those of you doing your orientation in the summer of 2020, your catalog year will be 2020 to 2021. And over on the left side, we're going to drop down to programs and we'll type in linguistics and press enter. Let's find the linguistics BA, which is the linguistics major here. And here you can have a detailed view of all the linguistics major requirements. Notice that there is a requirement of 60 credits total. And at least 10 of those credits 
will have to be from the study of a language. So you can study a non-Indo-European language, Chinese, Japanese, Arabic, or others under advisement, or an Indo-European language such as Spanish, French, German, Russian, Greek, Latin, or under, others under advisement. You will need to have at least one year of study of a non-Indo-European language or two years of study of an Indo-European language. The language requirement may be waived in some circumstances for native or fluent speakers or signers of non-English languages, in which case the required credits for the major will come from additional upper division linguistics courses under advisement. We've already discussed the first requirement of the major, which is an introduction to linguistics course. There are several other required courses. And we also have many other courses throughout the university that will actually count towards a linguistics major. So, for instance, we have some computer science courses that could count towards linguistics, some English language learners courses, English courses, French, German, Japanese, world language instruction, philosophy, psychology, Spanish, and teaching English to speakers of other languages. If any of this seems overwhelming to you, please don't fret. Reach out to me, Sarah Helms, or Kristen Denham, and we can help you through this process. Now let's go back to our linguistics website and talk about the minor. So again, this um, page will discuss information about the linguistics minor and the requirements and how to declare. To declare, there is no prerequisite. So as soon as you are enrolled at Western, you feel free to declare for the minor. Just go to the minor declaration and change web form, fill it out and email it to linguistics at www.edu. I will then work with you through email to complete a linguistics minor checklist, which looks like this. This is the linguistics minor degree planning guide. And we will complete this together so that you can keep track of your progress through the minor. Let's go back to Western's catalog. and search for the linguistics minor requirements, always making sure we're in the correct catalog year. Go to programs, type in linguistics, and press enter. Here's the linguistics minor link. The linguistics minor has a requirement of 24 to 25 credits. And these are the required courses. Again, an introduction to linguistics course. And a language and society course. Introduction to linguistics analysis. And two more upper division courses from this list. Let's go back to the linguistics website. If you're ever feeling like you have a question or overwhelmed or have a, a need advising or anything whatsoever, contact either myself or Kristen Denham. Let's click on this faculty and staff tab. 
Here you can find some information about everyone in our department. Kristen Denham is our department chair, and she's a fantastic resource for advising questions. And here's my contact information. My email address is here. You can call me if you'd like. You can request to have a Zoom appointment. But I find that most questions are I am able to answer through email. But I'm always happy to talk on the phone or to talk by Zoom. You can find other information about department faculty here as well. I believe that's all I wanted to cover in this video. Again, please feel free to reach out to me, Sarah Helms. My email address is h-e-l-m-s-s at w-w-u dot e-d-u. Take care. I look forward to talking to you.